If you're on a prescription drug, did you ever think that drinking a glass of grapefruit juice would be dangerous? Well, it's one of just many risky drug interactions that you need to be aware of. And in tonight's life, your life, your health, Julia Dunn looks at a few others. A glass of grapefruit juice may not be the best idea if you're taking something to treat a heart issue like high cholesterol. George Fredericks, pharmacy operations manager at Samaritan Hospital in Troy, says it interferes with drugs like Crestor, Provacol, and Lipitor. You drink the grapefruit juice, and the Lipitor is going to stay in the body. And then you take it the next day with the grapefruit juice, and it's going to stay in the body more. And, and you take it the next day, it's going to keep on staying in the body. And as blood levels of the drug keep rising, it causes a breakdown of muscle, often resulting in kidney failure. If you're on antibiotics, something like Levaquin, to treat a bacterial infection, keep this in mind. Certain vitamins should not be taken at the same time. Taking a calcium, iron, even magnesium vitamin every day cancels out what the drug is trying to do. Same goes for birth control. Certain antibiotics will cancel out the oral contraceptives, and that's something you, you don't want to run into. Frederick says check with your doctor to see if an antibiotic interferes with oral contraceptives. Finally, Sudafed. It works wonders as a decongestant. Trouble is, it'll keep you awake all night. Sudafed and Sudafed PE, um, if someone has insomnia, they're, they're going to stay awake. Even someone who doesn't have insomnia, that, that's part of what the drug does. Frederick says to be aware of all prescription and over-the-counter drugs that you're taking. There's always the chance that mixing meds can make another drug stronger, less strong, or cancel out one drug's effect altogether. For Your Life, Your Health, I'm Julia Dunn, CBS 6 News.